Well, it's currently about uh, gonna be 3 a.m. Check on the watch. It's gonna be 3 a.m. in just 15 minutes, and uh, I'm still woke. I uh, didn't shave, didn't do my hair as usual, always miss videos, but yeah, you can see I gotta go to the barber again, shit's getting too long. What we have in this cigar, um, what is this, the Alec Bradley, or the Alec and Bradley, which is the sons of Alec and Bradley, the cigar makers, I suppose, uh, they released a cigar, which is a limited experimental series called Project 40. This is meant to show people the joy brings smoking cigars. But we're not here to talk about cigars, are we? As a matter of fact, let's talk about Celtic Heroes. So we we'll start right now. Worry about the wasted time. Let's waste some time together. Logged in a couple of days, last two to three days. I had birthday basically, so I was busy with the wife and shit. Um, still at the tube spot. I think I missed it because I was drunk and passed out in a coma last night. You guys know I'm dead as honest all the time about this shit. And that's what happened. So uh, there's no no family friendly shit on this channel. Eh? So let's see what's up in the castle. Let's just flex on the boys with the shiny ass armor. Love this shit. Let's see who's online. Three people Chris and Lil Yuvo and me. Um, three cool guys. I'd say two men and one weeb, eh? Uh, shout out to Chris, I know this guy isn't watching any Celtic Cures videos, but you're a fucking weep, but you're still a legend, so I guess it's kinda cool, that's a trade-off. So let's see if we can hit a sneaky crit here, okay? Let's check it out. Yeah, I knew there wasn't a crit, so fuck that. Anyways, we tried our best, um, let's see what's up in the arena pretty quick, there's some cool people in there to talk to. Yeah, this cigar, it's good. It's a light and tasty smoke. So we got Magic Touch, Mr. Dark Phil, Rest. Red sounds like a guy that would do PvP. And we got Lord Virgin Packer. Holy shit, that name is awesome. We fucking want you. Oh, they're probably killing somebody. They're killing this guy, probably. So, so let's just fucking start it. That was cringe. Fuck this guy. He spotted me. Get him. Get him, boys. Get him. Get him. Magic touch from Hannah. Um, who's this? Let's check it out. Mr. Stogie. Dude, how the fuck does this guy know my Discord nickname? Knows me? The fuck? And anyways, I'm gonna be like, yo, what's up? <laughs> yo, what's up, hell? Long time no see. No, obviously, we're kidding, but, um, cool the people who recognize me. That's uh, cool. That's cool. Well, uh, thanks. Uh, I love you too. Uh, anyways, let's continue on with this video. So we want to talk about Catholic Kiros and why I think it's cool basically. So you guys know I quit the game. Yeah, I quit the game, right? I quit the game a couple of million times. Uh, let's get out of here before this turns to cringe. Sorry. Sorry, buddy. Um, I'm not sticking around because I feel it's, it's always a super cringe and shit. So I, I'll, I'll just fuck off. <laughs> yeah, I'm too shy for this shit. Anyways. So I said I quit the game a couple of times, which... Yeah, you guys can tell I quit the game, right? So here, here I am quitting the game, okay? Yeah, no bullshit, you can't quit this game, too addicted. But anyways, yeah, I said this game was kind of trash, and uh, my word kind of changed, my opinion changed. How's that happening? What? Your opinion changed? You a fucking human being? Thought you wasn't like the other, yeah, right, I failed you guys, I'm sorry. This game is not as garbagey as I most likely expected it or thought it was. Um, it's it's basically pretty fun to play. Man, this cigar is really good, really good. Anyways, anyways, um, I want to continue, continue with this video, and I know this, I hope it's not too cringe, um, so rock I troll, see if this guy can kill me, but anyway, so the game is kind of cool, like, the mistress attack, really, anyways, the game is kind of cool, one more thing to say, and this is to Mongo, Mongo, if you're watching this, I know you said I, I suck at hot swapping, you see, I'm, I'm so bad, I'm even casting skills when I'm not uh, attacking the mob, or the mob has a shield on or whatever, but anyways, yeah, I suck at hot swapping when I farm. I don't hot swap. It's, I don't care about this crap when I, hot swap, when I farm. It's it's not mandatory to hot swap, bro. There you go. And also, yeah, I'm talking over this video, so I, it's it's kind of hard for me, you know, to do both these things. I'm just playing. I'm a lazy bitch. I don't I, I don't really mind hot swapping it when I'm farming. I think hot swapping is for bosses. I hope everybody agrees. If not, then well, we're not the same opinion here. Sorry to disappoint. 
that was a nice crit so yeah anyways anyways let's continue on the game is kind of shit is what i always said and the game isn't shit guys look the game isn't shit okay before i get more complaints about my hot swap being completely trash i know it is when i farm i don't mind hot swapping when i farm it's, it's nothing nothing of interest i mean i do hot swap and i do bounties quite quite a lot so yeah by the way guys i leveled up holy shit i am now level two, 223 I got almost 200k, uh, that, that's <laughs> that's unfortunate. Where'd all the money go, you may ask? You may remember seeing my money in one of the previous videos where there was like uh, 2 or 3 mil gold. Yeah, that money is long gone, it's spent on uh, mount tokens, which is the sole only reason I'm doing bounties, two per day, <laughs> just to get uh, these mounts. So here's what I do, okay? I'm just teaching you how, okay? Look, I got a level 4 stable and a level 5 in equipment. And here's what I'll do, okay? Listen up. So I got 18 of these little shaders, right? 18. I need 25 to buy a purple one. And do, I need to do this four times so I get four purples. Then I can trade them in here um, for basically a one tier one silver, gray, whatever this is, horse. Okay, that's what I'm doing. Tactics, boys. That's how to be a fucking cheapskate all the time. Just, you don't want to pay money on this game. Still, I'm still holding my word to this day. Don't buy chests, boys. But the game is kind of fun. I want to talk to you. What 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 makes this game fun? Basically, the game is fun because of clans and friendships and bonds that, that formed over the years, weeks, or days or hours. You never know what kind of person you're playing with. Trust me. As people, I thought they were kind of cool and they they just backstab you in the end. And it's it's always like unfortunate if these people like they leave the clan and shit, and you're like, whoa, you're really not the person I thought you was. So. Yeah, it happened a couple of times over the, the past years, basically. Hard stuff, hard stuff. But I guess that's what happened when people check their personal problems, um, whatever boyfriend problems they may have, or psychological problems they may have, or whatever money problems, you never know, whatever problems, and they take it on the game, and it always sucks. Like, I think this is this not a second workplace. It's just a game to play in your free time, and have fun with friends online, okay? I know this may sound cringy, but I love all my online friends. Like, I love these guys. Like, to me, they're like real life friends. And I know you may think, like, yo, this is kind of cringe, you don't know these guys. Uh, well, yeah, I actually feel like I do. And that is why I love it when people, I really love it when people in my clan, in Concordia, actually use their real life pictures in their profile pics on Discord server. So I can kind of like form a bond with them or trust them. Because, and this is. Shout out to all the guys that still use enemy picks in 2020. I know you guys use these picks because you want to display something, but nobody that hasn't seen this enemy is ever gonna understand that. So, uh, use your real picks, you're beautiful human beings, trust me. So, yeah, this is basically a video about me talking random mad shit and telling you Celtic Heroes is cool. So, there you go, Celtic Heroes is cool. Change my opinion in the comments if you, if you feel like. And please, guys, no more questions about. What is the best spot to level at level XXX? Boys, come on. I teach you all that shit before in the previous videos. Just check them out for yourself. Okay, so I'll, I'll finish this one. Because uh, I really want to smoke my cigarette. See you guys in the next video. And as always, uh, take care. And remember to listen to your government. If they say wash your hands, then wash your hands. If they tell you don't drink alcohol, uh, yeah, you can drink alcohol still. But, you know, you just you just gotta pretend you're not doing your friends, okay? I know nobody, nobody watching. That is below 18 or 20. I said 25, whatever. No one of you is giving a fuck about this corner stuff, right? You're all just so fucking selfish. You're like, yo, chill out the weekends with the pals and shit. Boys, I understand the why, but please stay at home. Stay safe. COVID isn't a joke, okay? That being said, see you guys in the next video. And yeah, this is finally the end of this video. I cringed you guys out enough. Stay safe, boys. Don't take it so serious. Everything in life is a love story. Don't take it so serious It shouldn't be so scary, it's a fairy tale Don't take it so serious